this is Jet and today's tutorial we're going to learn how to make a duct tape mini top hat. These attach to your hair just with a couple clips and can be incorporated into many different fun outfits. Um, you can have it as sort of formal occasion accessory such as duct tape prom and you could also use it for things like burlesque outfits or sweet or gothic lolita outfits as i'm showing um so anyways let's get started this is going to be a really easy tutorial and i hope you guys first you're going to need two circle templates one should be about three inches uh in diameter and then the other one should be about four inches in diameter. I got together a couple things that are about the right size. If you get a unopened roll of duct tape, not patterned, so it should be the uh, 20 yard rolls of tape, that should be about the right size for the bigger circle. I got a bracelet here to be the smaller circle. You could also use a um, an empty roll of duct tape would work. Uh, the top of a peanut butter jar, skippies, I realized worked. Uh, just go around the house and find two objects that are circle shaped that are about the right size and you're going to use those as your template. Now get the color that you're going to want and make two circles from that. What I suggest is make them squares and then cut the circles out of them instead of cutting one circle and then attempting to piece the duct tape together like that. After you've gotten your two circles, you're going to want a sheet of duct tape uh, three inches tall that is the entire perimeter of the smaller circle. Um, I'm thinking it's going to be about nine inches. Make it a little longer if you're not sure and you can always cut it to size. Okay, so now you're going to want to attach this to this. First, what you're going to want to do is cut lots of little one inch sheets of duct tape. So just one inch by one inch. Actually, since this is so small, we might want to go by the half inch. So let's do that. See this? one inch by one half inch piece. We're going to use a lot of these to connect all of the round areas. So on this you're going to want to start by placing it half onto your long sheet of duct tape and then taking the circle on any edge of the circle and then folding it over. like that. And now you're going to curl it in and slowly piece by piece keep adding these little small connectors.
Once you get to the end, if you have any extra, just go ahead and cut that off. And then get a thin strip of duct tape, the height, and tape it together and then put that last connector piece on. And now you have the top of your top hat. You're going to do pretty much the same thing to connect this piece to this piece, only it's going to be a little harder because they're going to be bending in a different direction. You can also use these little connector pieces to line the very bottom circle if you want to make the edge not show. Keep cutting out these little half inch by one inch pieces and just put them around the edge. So when you start connecting this piece to this piece, you're going to want to make sure that it's on evenly. There is not a great way to do that um, unless you want to take a small measure and measure around all of the edges. Uh, you could also eyeball it by placing it on your mat and spinning it around and making sure that they're all about the same distance. And then once you have that, you're going to want to take at least four of these and tape down the corners first so that, the, so that this piece stays stationary. I already have one placed right there, so I'm going to place the rest. like that and then you can just start laying down the pieces all around and I should mention that unlike here where you probably lined up your lines perfectly you don't have to worry about that so much with this edge because eventually you're going to be putting a ribbon around it most likely that's probably the most usual decoration for a top hat so if you got kind of jaggedy lines right here it'll most likely be covered later all right so get started on that And now you're almost done. There's just two more things you're going to want to do. You're going to want to add a hair clip of some sort to the bottom of this. You might want to have two. Um, alligator, clip, alligator clips work really good with this, in my opinion. Um, but just anything that's going to you know, attach this to your hair, you're going to want to add to the bottom just by taping the clip down. You're also going to want to decorate it. I do suggest at least putting a small, at least one inch, maybe two inch duct tape ribbon around the top here. And that's pretty simple, just make a ribbon and tape it. You might also want to add a duct tape bow, a duct tape rose or some sort of flower, a duct tape ribbons coming off the side. There's a lot of different ways that you can decorate it, so I'm going to let you think of that for yourself. For now, I'm just going to add a ribbon made with this paper that I bought for Valentine's Day. Um, so yeah, there, you can sort of have fun with it at this point. This is just a base for you to add more things pretty much. So when you're all done, you should have something like this. And again, like I said, I just added a basic ribbon, which is, you know, just a very normal sort of 
accessory that you could add to a top hat and you can even make these interchangeable have different colors but I also encourage you to add some more things to it if you like you can add a little flower or bow or anything that you want coming off the side and these are normally worn maybe just a little bit slightly to the side and you just clip it in your hair and you're good to go so I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you for watching